So we were in Georgia for this year's Southern Werther Sea event, and we caught up with Ben and Mike from Stanceworks. Mike Burroughs had brought out his uh, very unique long-term BMW E36 build for the first time. And we know a lot of people have been following his build with that car for quite a while. We sat down with Ben and Mike uh, to learn more about the car and about Stanceworks. Well, it's a 93 325IS, and uh, we swapped the S54 out of an E46 M3 into it. It's a 3.2 liter straight six, makes 333 horsepower factory, and uh, we decided to do the swap pretty much as BMW would have done it, run it on a factory DME, uh, run the full EWS system, uh, E46 cluster, everything, you know, just do it right. It took a lot of time to do it, it took three years just to wire it all together. Um, it was me and my buddy Eric who uh, built the whole thing in a garage. After we got it pretty much to the point of completion, we decided to uh, give it a little bit of flair. And uh, my buddies up at Fluid Motor Union uh, helped us out with the stack setup and some final wiring and whatnot. The funny looking trumpet things, uh, there are velocity stacks coming off of each throttle body. Um, the advantage is uh, you know, quicker throttle response and improved uh, intake. It's showing. Uh, anywhere from 30 to 60 wheel horsepower gains, uh, depending on the car, the tune, the mods, and whatnot. It was important that I brought it out, you know, if nobody's seen it in three years, I wanted to bring it out, you know, on something totally new. So I went with the AMGs, 17 by 8 and a half, 70 by 10. Um, no spacers, had them re-drilled from 5x112 to 5x120, uh, and they're pretty much on point. I'm really pleased with it. I'm, I'm looking forward to the reaction from you know, the hardcore BMW guys with Ben's wheels on the car. Well, the big thing we wanted to do in debuting the E36 along with the motor build was um, a side project that we've been working on and uh, for, for Stanceworks the motto is lowest lifestyle but there's really not a solution out there for a coilover, a static suspension that actually rides good, performs good and sits about two or three inches off the ground and so we teamed up with uh, AST Suspension essentially built a system which uh, shortened the strut housing to allow for more travel up the spring rates considerably um, and then valved it appropriately. So at this point, that car sitting as it is is static but never bottoms out, sits about two or three inches off the ground and handles like it's on rails with a passenger in there. After we debut the car, uh, our intention is to keep this very boutique. We're going to build 20 systems for every platform we do and that's it. These systems are very impressive. We're very excited to launch it.